well, Marissa, you know, four-year starter for you. And, you know, when she first got here, obviously you probably know about her a little bit coming up for the junior high ranks. How ready was she as a freshman to kind of step in and be a major part of your of your team that year? Um, her skills were beyond ready, mm -hmm. I think, overall. Um, she could handle back row play, front row play. She was ready to compete at a high level and was used to that competition level. She... Um, she has grown up so much emotionally in her maturity level, which, you know, all kids do, but it's been fun for me to see it because I don't always get the chance of seeing that from freshman year to senior year. So, um, yeah, she was, she was ready to go and it's been, it surpassed my expectations now. Yeah, and, you know, you talk about the, the leadership type aspect of it. And this year probably really key for you guys because each of her first three years, she's kind of always had that upperclassman that, you know, she could kind of bank on as being, you know, one of the team leaders. And then this year with, with such an inexperienced team coming back and even your other two returners, young players, uh, I think just sophomores, yeah. you know, she kind of had to, that, that was going to be her role this year no matter what. Um, yeah, she's taken on such a positive leadership role, you know, and it's gotten, and I don't know, I just, I've seen a, a very mature grown up um, part of her and come out this year and it's been positive and it's been something that girls have been following so it's been great. Yeah you know most of her career she's also kind of been a complimentary hitter to, to Alyssa or to Alex and then you know last year maybe kind of taking over more of the lead role this year she's obviously your go-to uh, attacker you know how does she handle that kind of transition from being a player who could kind of feed off other people to being the player other people feed off of? She loves it. <laughs> She's great. She, she loves it. She wants to take the pass and she wants to get set and she wants to put the ball away. And she doesn't, she's, like I said, you know, she's grown up a lot. She doesn't let uh, one error, you know, hold her back from the next play or um, getting blocked, you know. She's, she's got tougher skin than she did in the past and she's, she's ready to take it on for yeah. sure. How does she compare to Alyssa and Alex when, you know, when Alex was fully healthy and, and Alyssa obviously a great player yeah. she had. How does she compare as a, as a player to them, uh, you know, maybe a little bit more all-around player in terms of front row, back row, but, you know, how does she compare to those girls? Yes. Um, honestly, I've never seen somebody take a pass and take a, a dig so well, move back, and then be able to hit the way she can. Mm -hmm. um, so, yeah, definitely a, a, a wonderful all-around player. Um, Al, you know, Alex and Alyssa, of course, they were good hitters too, but, you know, Marissa, she's got some hops. She's mm -hmm. a little thing out there, you know, and she gets up and she sees the court well. She just has grown up with the game of volleyball and has known it, you know, so um, she does a lot without little body. <laughs>